at 5. The life of Keith Sonye. Well, the Lafayette Fire Department said a final farewell to him today. Inspector Chief Keith Sonye passed away suddenly at his home on October 11th. News 10's Danielle Johnson spoke to family, friends, and fellow firemen. It's evident the type of person Chief Keith Sonye was for the Acadiana community. Everyone I've talked to since his passing says how great of a man he was and how he was truly an honorable person. I look at Keith, three things that come to mind for me is that family, um, uh, public servant, and humanity. These are the words of Lafayette Fire Chief Robert Benoit, a colleague and longtime friend of Fire Inspector Chief Keith Sonye. The veteran firefighter of over 30 years was honored with a procession involving law enforcement, the Honor Guard, and the Lafayette Fire Department. He was then taken to the Cajun Dome Convention Center, where the community he serves for over three decades bid a final farewell to their hero. Crowds of people gathered forming long lines, everyone having the same memory of the type of man he was. He was a good man. Anybody needed help with anything, he was there, he'd help you. Nedra Alexander, who works with the Lafayette Parish School System, and Dina Neighbors, a close family member, says the tragedy impacts the entire community. Love is evident by the people that you see who have gathered to celebrate his life. He gave much to his community, and we are all grateful for his presence in our lives. He will be truly missed. Alexander says it was one of Chief Sonye's missions to help uplift and inspire kids. The Lafayette Parish school system will never forget him. He would come into the schools and teach the children about fire safety and was just loved by the entire community with the LPSS. And he will be truly missed. 